Let's integrate 1 over 1 plus sin x plus cos x. Even though there's another way to do it, but I will show you guys with the wire straps substitution. And we have all these ingredients right here ready for us already. So here we have integral 1 on the top over 1 plus sin x is that, right? So let's write down 2t over 1 plus t squared. And then we add it with cos x, which is the 1 minus t squared over 1 plus t squared. And don't forget, we still have the dx, which is this, 2 over 1 plus t squared dt. Okay? And now we just have to simplify this a little bit before we can actually integrate. We have the integral 1 times 2, let's just put a 2 on the top, over, well, let's put this in the parentheses and this in the parentheses because we have to take this and distribute, distribute, right? We take this, multiply with 1 first, and we just get 1 plus t squared. And then we add it with the second term times that, right? But then 1 plus t squared, they will cancel each other out. We will just have 2t. And then we take this, multiply with that. So we add it with, once again, the 1 plus t squared, they cancel out which will just have 1 minus t squared. Very nice. This is dt. All right, you see this is plus t squared, and this is minus t squared. Of course, cancel, cancel. And let's see what else do we have. We have the integral. On the top, we have 2 over 1 plus 1, which is 2, and then plus 2t, and this is dt, right? So what can we do? Well, of course, you can factor out 2 in the denominator, and then this is 1 plus t. So this 2 and that 2 will cancel, and this is just integral of 1 on the top over 1 plus t. dt, isn't it, right? And how can we integrate 1 over 1 plus t? Well, this is going to be ln absolute value of 1 plus t, and we are done with the integration part. At the end, we write t as the original tangent of x over 2. So this is ln absolute value 1 plus tangent of x over 2, and then we are done. Put plus c, this is it.